Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you. And welcome back to another video for the TGC Tours and my journey through it. Currently sitting in second place in the Alistair McKenzie Heritage here at Marlott Fells. Great round one. 11 under. I'm feeling real good. We're about to go out and crush round two. Hopefully you've had a good Christmas day if you celebrate it. Got all the presents you were looking for. Everybody who you got presents for was ecstatic to receive them. The meals have been good if you've ate them. If not, I hope you have a good Christmas day with the family. Maybe you celebrate it late, like me and my family. If there is one thing that I want for Christmas, though, it's the gift of a good round two. Because we're trying to make the cut here, and we're trying to win a freaking tournament, okay? We're trying to win a tournament. And I'm so amped up. I'm just literally going to get right, right to it. So this is what we have. Harder conditions. Very firm fairways. Very firm greens. Very fast green speed. That's a yikes. Wind direction is north. Wind speed is default, which is medium in play now. But in the society, who knows? It could be very high. It could be none. I, I, I just, I don't know. Time of day is done. Weather's clear. <laughs> and that's it. Let's just jump right into this. And let's go out and shoot another 10, 11, 12 under. Maybe move into first place. Let's get it done. Here we go. All right. So it looks like we're working with medium wind. Medium wind. I'm going to try to actually get this up on the left side today. That should be good. We should be able to get a nice cool two wood up there, I'm thinking. Hopefully. Ooh. Ooh. We're gonna try. We're gonna try. That line's pretty good. Not gonna have the distance though. Dang. That's alright. Nice cool calm flop shot up there. All right, let's get a birdie. Let's get a birdie going here. Start her off with a bird. I'll take it. I will take it. We are one under yet again. Yet again. What do we got? 21 feet up. Wind's going to be slightly in our face. We got to get this right of the hole, though. Get more right. No. Stop. Stop. Cool. Great game. Great game, dude. Great game. Let's keep that up. All right, we can make this. We can make this. All right, I believe. I believe. All right, I feel like we're going to beat through a lot of this initial break. Gonna go with that. Ooh, not hard enough. Not hard enough. I'll take a par. That's really unfortunate that it just didn't didn't get the distance to make it up that hill and just rolled all the way back down. That's highly unfortunate. You can probably get over this, right? Oh, yeah, with ease. That's actually really good. Flat surface, flattish surface, and we're going to be using a wedge coming in. 
Where are we at here? Eh. Not the easiest of shots, that's for sure. That's got to get way left. Man, that's unfortunate. I pushed it a little bit. And the wind had no shot. Alright, don't hit this too hard. Stay up. And there it goes. Gosh darn it. All right, another par. Still feeling all right. One under. Tom Father is actually, I think he's the one who's in first right now. The very firm is a killer. The very firm, very firm, very fast. Like, that's... Do not go bunker. Okay. That's tough. It's very, very tough. Ooh, we are going balls to the wall into the wind here. Oh, I pushed it. Oh, man. That sucks. That was going to be pretty good distance, too. Oh, do I putt this? No, I got to chip this. Yee! Wow, that went very far. 80% power. I fasted, though. Did you see how much that broke at my feet? What? Nine times out of ten, I beat through that break. <laughs> One time out of ten, it breaks a full, like, three inches to the right. Gosh darn it. Why? Huh? Why? I'm going to try to get over this. Oh, we're good. We're going to be bringing an iron into this. We really need an eagle now. We need an eagle bad here. We got to get back that uh, bogey. Can't hit any better than that. Get up the hill. Very firm. Very firm. Very fast. No. Okay. We still got a pretty good shot at an eagle here. Working uphill here. Man. I thought with the very firm, I would have got a bigger bounce, especially with the wind in my back. Eagle me. Wow, did I not give it? Oh, I did. Wow, that looked like it died out a bunch. That was a bad read. That was a bad read. We got a birdie, though. We got that bogey right back, which is good. One under. Just got to convert some of these here. Uh-oh. We'll be all right. Whew. I actually got a little worried there. Uh, 
I got a little worried there. Oh, Jesus, look at this. Didn't want to push it that much. Wow, this putt's going to really suck. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Break, 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 break. That's fringe. Wow. Hit it too hard. Alright, this is a big par putt. Oh, Louis, we saved that. We're going to have to have a really big back nine. This course is already difficult. Like, scoring a low low round this round, that's going to be... If somebody can do that, good on them, because this course is already difficult to score at. You add in, like, this factor. The very firm, very firm. I pushed it again. The very firm, very firm, very fast. And then you do some asshole pin placements. Like, that's really tough. All right, another par. Still one under. Another par five. Mm, don't think we're going to be able to make it again. Just because of the wind. We'll lay up again. <laughs> it always wants me to go for it. Do we? No, no, we can't. There's no way. There's no way I'd make that. I might be flopping this up. No, I'm not going to make... There's no way I'd flop that. Good distance. Very good distance. Let's go, dude. That's a really good shot in the air. Another birdie. I've been doing really good on the par fives, which is spectacular. I don't know what this is, what's going to happen with the wind on the last par five. It's probably going to be in my face, right? Should still be able to hit it through there and maybe two wood it in. Yeah, should be able to. Run this down the hill. Does an 8-iron run down that? It's very firm, so I'm going to get a pretty big kick here. Oh, that probably would have been pretty good distance there. Man.
Oh, a little bit, man. I I shouldn't, uh, if I would have lofted that a little bit less, that probably would have been really good. Another big pot. Not an easy one, either. Stay up. That was close. A little too close. So we close out the front nine, two under. We got to put together a really, really good back nine here. If I want to keep my shot alive at winning this thing. I pushed it. Is that bunker? Oh my gosh, get through there. Oh, that was pretty close. Whew, that is tough. Off the green. Sit. No. Might be able to putt this. I'm going to try. Wow, that actually died before it even got there. That's not good. Another really big putt. Man. Stay up, please. Oh. Bummer. Another bogey. Just because... I undershot that putt off off the fairway. Damn, dude, that's tough. That's really tough. Mm. I thought I could get it up there. I was wrong. I was wrong. Hopefully this comes out uh, 95. It sure did. I even perfect perfect that. Like how does how does that come out at a hundred? It's <sighs> it's okay. It's okay. I don't know how that comes out at 100, but whatever. It is what it is. And then I fast fast it. Please sit. Let's try to save par here. I, I, that's so confusing how that came out so clean. I even lofted it up too. Man, one under through 11. Now what you want. And then I fast it. I had perfect distance and I fasted it. Although I'm pretty sure I didn't, but that's... Either here or there. All right, let's try to get a par. All right, up and down it. We got to get on a. We got to get on a really big run here. Because we're falling way behind. We're falling so far behind. We 
need an eagle on that par five. We need a, we need some birdies here. We need some birdies bad. Too far right. Too far right. Got a shot at a bird though here. Green isn't too bad. These are the putts you need to make. Especially on this course. Stay up. I didn't hit that enough? Really? Man. And it all comes crashing down. This is probably going to be a true two wooden. We need an eagle here. Badly. Oh, we're not going to get it. I'm going to try to fast this and see if I can run it down this hill. This is going to be a really tough shot, though. That's about as good as I can get it. Good kick. Run, 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 run. I hate you. <laughs> yeah, dang it. Get in there. Get in there! Oh, no. oh, please. Why aren't you breaking more? Man. Come on. Do I two-wood this down? I feel like I need to. I need to get green, though. I need a lot of green here. This is actually a pretty good spot right here. This is a pretty good spot. Socks is... the shot, but... kick great kick get in the hole get in the hole get in the hole get in the hole <laughs> Come on, dude. Come on. Come on. oh my gosh okay that's all right another birdie look at the positive just gotta look at the positives all right we're making a move here todd father's running away with it we can at least try to get up nice and close though and you just need to birdie out essentially Which we can do. We can birdie out. Starts right here. This is actually a really good shot right here. Coming into the screen. This isn't going to end well. I needed that shot. Oh, I needed that badly. This is good. Really needed that. That's good. Good birdie shot again here. Which we nail. All right. 
The birdie out begins. 15 under. We can get to 17 under. Depending on wind, we might be able to hit that par, the last hole, par four. And if we get a hole in one here. Please. Please. Please, can we get a hole in one? That'd be a really good Christmas present. That'd be a really good Christmas present. It'd be like the best Christmas present, you know? Y you can't just roll a little bit further. Hit that slope just a little bit harder, you know? <sighs> Another birdie. Okay, let's see if we can hit this and get an eagle. That would be great. Hell, let's albatross it. Five under, though. We've kind of come on strong here at the end. Where's the wind at? Ooh. We can do this. We can do this. We can definitely do this. Hey, it's going to be real hard, but... And we pretty much have to hit the perfect shot. And I didn't. Good kick, maybe? Oh, it's going way long. See you later, ball. Well, that didn't work out. That fast really screwed me. <sighs> this pin placement is... This is crazy. Look at this. This is nuts. Stay up. Let's go, baby. Okay. We came on very, very strong there at the end. Six under. Not, not the most ideal, but six under. Very firm, very firm, very fast conditions, and these pin placements. I'm actually okay with that. I am, I am okay with that. That's a, that's a decent round. And I will take that to the bank any day of the week. Todd Father gained a stroke again on me. I'll probably drop out of a top two. I'll, I might still be a top five position, though. We'll have to wait and see. Because, uh, I mean, this is like, uh, this is where people are tested. When you get, you know, the people who shoot 10 under, 9 under, 8 under, me, 11, 12. This is where they get tested on these conditions with these pin placements. I went out strong. Five birdies to end it. Holy cow. That is absolutely spectacular. I am feeling really good about this, though. We'll see where it shakes out when the leaderboards update. But I'm feeling pretty good. Feeling pretty confident. I think I've put myself in a position heading into round three and four to actually potentially win it. I think I'm in a decent enough position right now that if I shoot two really good rounds, I can maybe win it. We're going to try. Thanks for watching, though. I greatly, greatly appreciate it. If you enjoyed this video, think about giving it a like or even subscribe to the channel. We do do this every single week. Sunday with course introductions. Rounds one through four done Tuesday through Friday. I also stream over at twitch.tv slash respawn TV. If you're interested in other content that I do, head on over there, drop a follow. But thanks for watching. I hope you have a great Christmas if you have not celebrated it yet with the family. And I will catch you all back here tomorrow for round three coverage of the Alistair McKenzie Heritage. Thanks for watching. Talk to you guys tomorrow. Deuces.